This video will explain in detail how to remove photos from iPad only, but not iPhone, iCloud, or other devices. Part 1. How to back up iPad photos before deleting them. Before deleting photos, you can transfer them to your computer to avoid data loss. With Coolmuster iOS Assistant, you can easily back up photos to your computer with one click. Step 1. Download, install, and launch the software on your computer. Connect your iPad to the computer using a USB cable. If prompt, tap trust and then continue to go on. Step 2. Once the connection is successful, you will see the interface as shown below. Step 3. Navigate to the left sidebar, select the photos category and choose the pictures you want to transfer. After selecting the desired photos, click export to transfer them from your iPhone to your computer. Part 2. How to delete photos from iPad but not iCloud or iPhone. If you want to delete photos from your iPad but keep them on your iPhone and in iCloud, you need to disconnect your iPad from iCloud. 2.1. Delete photos from iPad only by turn off iCloud photos. This will stop photo synchronization between your iPad and iCloud, ensuring that photos on other devices are not affected. Step 1. Open the Settings app on your iPad. Step 2. Tap your Apple ID, then select iCloud. Step 3. Choose the Photos option. Step 4. Turn off iCloud Photos. Step 5. After that you will be given to options. Delete photos from iPad and download photos and videos. Remove photos from iPad quickly delete all iCloud photos from your iPad. Download photos and videos download iCloud photos to your iPad and then manually delete any unwanted ones. 2.2. Erase photos from iPad only by log out of iCloud account. By doing so, you can ensure that any actions on your iPad will not sync with iCloud or other devices. Step 1. Open the Settings app and tap your Apple ID at the top. Step 2. Scroll down and tap Sign Out. You'll be prompted to enter your Apple ID password and choose which data to keep on the device. Step 3. After signing out, you can delete photos from your iPad without affecting the photos in iCloud. Step 4. You can also choose to sign in with a different iCloud account. This makes your iPhone and iPad independent, which is a good option if you want to remove photos from your iPad but keep them on your iPhone. Thank you.